For Megan, the Georgetown Police Department tells us that officers were sent to Airport Road at around 8.45 p.m. last night for a report of a possible homicide with an active hostage situation. Now, police say that while officers assessed that situation, that the Brown County SWAT team was put on standby. According to Georgetown Police Department Captain Matt Staggs, officers quickly determined that the call was a prank known as swatting. And it was during the investigation of this incident that police say the caller said he was going to prank Georgetown schools as well. Now, school officials have since stated that a swatting call was made to one of their students at his home. Police say they have determined that the person involved with the call does not pose any danger to the school. Now, Georgetown exempted village schools have released a statement on Facebook that says in part, the police are well aware of this threat and so are the Georgetown administrators. In the event a swatting occurs to either schools, we will immediately go into lockdown and follow all safety procedures. Student safety is always a top priority and we will not fold to idle threats. Now, police tell us they were able to determine the suspect's location and that it is out of state. They say the investigation is ongoing and could potentially result in criminal charges. From the alert desk, Candace Hare, Fox 19 News.